the, the state of the business is it has fluctuated and changed so much since we started writing this film. We started writing it uh, truly about nine or ten years ago, and have gone through different iterations of financing over the years. And last year, it, the stars just finally aligned for us, and so it really has changed a lot. And there were dozens of drafts, and once. Mike, Sarah came on board, and Maya came on board. Then it started to become more real. So it was just about finding the right, the right piece financially, who was willing to kind of you know believe in our vision and, and see it through with us. And we found it, and it was amazing. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Awesome. Sorry, sorry? Yes, okay, so I play Jess, who's a really good friend of Ariel, and we are these two women that Michael and Michael's characters run into on their road trip to Sacramento, and we really teach them a lot about their own relationship in this movie. So I think the two of us, the way that we support each other, kind of holds a mirror up to the two of them, and they it's a real turning point the weekend that they spend with us. Are there any challenges that you had to face yes. during this film? Honestly, no. This is like one of the best sets I've, I mean, if not the best set I've ever been on. Michael knows how to run a really grounded set. So it was just so much fun to be part of this crew and this cast, which is just like, it's so insanely amazing. I feel very, very grateful. And do you have anything else coming up that you'd like to share? Yeah, um, I have a movie coming out called Daft State later in September. It's a psychological thriller. And then also I'm about to start filming this another psychological psychological thriller um, with Mina Savari called Anatomy of the Sun. And that'll be coming out probably sometime <laughs> late next year. Thank you so awesome, thank you. <laughs> These are so cute, I'm dying. I'm Ashley Rickon Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Ashley. Can you want to see your character in the film? What's that? I'm so sorry. Yes, my character is a an athlete who is dealing with this transition in her life, becoming a mother, and she's really kind of lost her identity in that, and so she's trying to rediscover herself as a woman on her own, not just as a mother. And so she's in this sort of irresponsible moment, and that's where we kind of meet her in the movie. And what this is kind of journey does your character go through? Um, it's really beautiful to see the female friendship that's represented through this movie where my character and Iman's character support each other through my character's really um, existential crisis <laughs> um, and so we really get to see her try way too hard to find a date that night let's put it politely um, and then what she discovers is that she just needs to get her emotions out it's not about getting laid it's about getting her mind understood and releasing this tension in her brain um, that she doesn't have to have it all figured out. And that ev next evolution in life is actually a beautiful thing. Were there any memorable, memorable moments on set? Oh my gosh, yes. There is a scene uh, that you will see that may have some pro wrestling in it. <laughs> I don't want to spoil anything. But it was really cool to be around a ring again. I'm a retired pro wrestler, and to be kind of help the guys with some moves was a lot of fun. And they were so down for everything. It's so funny. Uh, the Michaels are the dream team. Well, thank you. Congratulations on the coverage. Thank you so much.